Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Millie, this is Dry With Plants, and today I wanna to share a small grocery haul of what we picked up. We stopped at Trader Joe's and Whole Foods, and this entire month we have actually been focusing on getting majority of organic produce and making sure that the stuff that we get is organic just for the benefits of it. Only totally a personal choice, but that's the route that we have decided to go. So let me show you what we picked up. Like I said, most of this is organic produce with the exception of the grapes because they did not have organic grapes. Craving grapes and I had been craving um, cherries during this pregnancy of mine. I'm going to start off with these. My husband has been going to the gym and asked his post snack. He loves having rice cakes with um, nut butter and banana and some cinnamon and flaxseed. So we picked up one of those, picked up some marinara sauce because I'll, I'll mention it right now why we picked this up, but I picked up a jar of marinara. I picked up some peanut butter. Um, I have originally had been getting uh, almond butter, but because of the extra just um, good fat content in this peanut butter, I decided to go with this instead of the almond butter. So I love having like peanut butter toast or butter toast it's so good with some banana and flaxseed it's delicious I plan on making some bean and rice burritos later this week so picked up some limes some tomatoes for sandwiches as you guys know maybe a salsa or just in our pita pockets too we love having tomato in there I uh, picked up two cucumbers for our pasta salad and also for the sandwiches two serrano peppers if I decide to make the salsa instead then, yep, I have those. Picked up two large um, white onions because we're making some fajita tacos. I will link that down below. They were really tasty, so we're planning on making that for dinner tonight or one of these uh, weeknights. Picked up some cilantro for the burrito, some oranges. I have been loving oranges, they're so tasty. Uh, picked up some avocados, and like I said, the grapes and the cherries and some pears. My husband loves pears, so we have a few of those. We have one, one for each day of the week. I have been loving the green apples. These, I think, are my favorite. They're sour and just so good. My husband doesn't like these, so these are the ones that I have. We also picked up some Fuji apples because these are my husband's personal favorite. And also some honey crisp apples. These are my, these and these are like tied for my favorite apples because they're so good. This one's super sweet, the honey crisp, but they are also super pricey. So I only got three and balanced them out with the Granny Smith and I picked these up at Trader Joe's actually because they were just cheaper there. Picked up some carrots as well because I had a ran out and I always like having these on hand because you could throw these into like a pasta or you can throw these um, in a burrito bowl or in a sushi roll. So having these on hand is always awesome. Also, you can make stir fries with these. So of course, love having those on hand. I love cashews. They are my favorite. Sometimes I <laughs> I get Victor annoyed because when he gets the mixed ones, I always take out the cashews. And so this time he, he just told me, just get yourself a bag full of just cashews. So it's a, it's a purchase that I'm really happy to get because I love cashews. And uh, recently we went to a restaurant that had um, like the vegan feta and it was actually really good. I remember trying like back in the day the regular feta, like the dairy feta, and I did not like it. I thought it was gross, but I really liked this dairy free feta cheese. So I'm thinking about maybe putting it in a salad or maybe if I make pasta, putting it on top. It was actually really tasty. So if you haven't tried it, you should try it if you've been looking for like a cheese alternative. And we have been having a lot of tofu, just adding some extra, you know, uh, protein to our meals and tofu is really good. And my husband now is a fan of tofu. He didn't like tofu for like the longest time. He refused to eat it and try it, but now he really likes it. So we picked up two of those and also picked up some tempeh. I I'd always seen tempeh but like I never knew what it was and when I figured out that it was just tofu and um, 
for like soybeans and brown rice. It sounded more appetizing than just the name tempeh or the way that it looked. But I'm excited to try it. I don't know how I'm going to make this. So if you guys have any recipes for how to marinate tempeh or cook tempeh, then link them down below if you can or just type it down below. I would love to know how to cook this properly. And another thing that my husband and I have realized is that we are not huge fans of whole wheat pasta. We just cannot get over the taste. Sometimes it's fine, but most of the time it's just not as good. And so when we do have pasta, I do opt for just a normal white pasta. So I picked up a penne bag as well as an elbow pasta bag just because... Um, this works perfectly for our pasta that I make, the hummus pasta with some uh, red onion, some tomato, some cucumber. It's really, really tasty. I also picked up this ancient grain mix. They're like little microwavable pouches and it sounds really good and it's easier. I mean, you just have to pop it in the microwave and put something else beside it. So we just decided to give that a try. Something that I am honestly really excited for and this sounded so good was this tortellini. We used to have tortellini in our college like every Sunday. Um, so I really wanted to try this uh, Kite Hill tortellini. It sounds so good. It looks amazing. And this is what we're using the marinara pasta sauce for. And then I'm going to make some mashed potatoes. And it just sounds so, so good. So I'm excited to try that. And picked this up for my husband. He loves having overnight oats. And he loves topping it off with some of this granola. It's actually really tasty. So... This is for his oatmeal. Also picked up some soy sauce, because we had run out. Got some sweet corn, some garbanzo beans, and then we're gonna try that um, can of chili beans. I've never had it before. I'm not a huge fan of chili beans, but my husband says they're really good, so I'm gonna give that a try. Oh, and we also got a ton of bananas, but there's, there's a lot of them, so we just didn't put them on the counter. We got a lot of bananas for smoothies and for snacks, because those are easy on the go snacks and that wraps up today's grocery haul thank you so much for watching if you haven't already please hit the like button and subscribe down below if you would like to see more videos like this